Hello, welcome to this tutorial. In this tutorial I'm going to show you how to repaint an aircraft. So I've loaded the flight up just so we can preview it later when we've done it. And just go to your aircraft folder, whatever you're going to repaint, you can repaint any aircraft. So I've just copied and pasted texture white and renamed it texture.test. You need to remember that dot test. And go to aircraft.config, open that up. And if you go down to the bottom of the liveries, the bottom one is Flight Sim 20, so we'll just copy and paste that underneath, change it to Flight Sim 21. Then it says Title Commercial Level Simulations A330200 White. Just change it to Test, whatever you want. But just don't rename it, like don't rename it White again as it won't come up in Flight Sim. Then UI Variation Test. Again, whatever you want. And this texture equals white, and we called it dot test, so that's test. So that's what which texture file to look up tells it which one to do. And just save that and close it. And you can see, you know, in FSX you get thumbnails, and I've just repainted the thumbnail to be very standoutable. Just go to check that it's there in Flight Sim. And find it in here somewhere. There we go. See it shows up compared to the rest. And there's just a blank white texture, good for painting onto. And just cancel that uh, aircraft selection. Uh, let's paint onto the tail. You need a program called DX DXT1 Bitmap Manipulator, which I've put the download link into the description. So we'll just open that up. And then here you can select the editor. I'm using paint.net. So we'll just where I select the exe file for the editor. Um, once you've done that, image in the toolbar at the top. Send to editor. And if you want like to get more yeah, you, know, you know, better looking repaint. You know, I'm using paint.net. I'm saying it's not a tutorial for paint.net, don't ask me any questions about that. Um can't both transfer them. <laughs> Go to layers, add new layer, properties, multiply and press OK. Then just paint onto that layer two. I'm just going to select part of the aircraft because I don't want to paint onto the background or anything. So, in layers, just click background, go to magic wand in the tools. Oops, that's too much, so let's change the tolerance down. So, just basic selection, not fancy. And go back to layer 2, line curve, change it 100. Nice bright colour. Blue. And just draw it onto the aircraft. Ooh, and we'll have a yellow. Mess around with colours, whatever. There we go. And just layer two, just move that down, like merge layer down button there. So it's all just one layer before you save it. Just deselect that. Save, press OK, it just saves to a temporary file. Then go back to your DXT bitmap in the toolbar, image, reload after edit. You can see it's come up there. <coughs> File, save, save. Do you want to overwrite? Yes, because you want to overwrite the white texture. Saving. And then go to a flight sim, just see if it's updated, which it will have.
can see there what we've just drawn. Just cancel that down, cancel, and that's it. That's just how you repaint. Simple when you get the hang of it. And thanks for watching. Please rate, comment, subscribe, whatever. Ask any questions that you want. And see you in the next tutorial. Thanks.